Yo, what up? I'm going to show you real quick how to set up all instruments mode on RPCS3 Rock Band 3. I'm going to go ahead and boot the game. But I'm going to set up some pads and just show you how I have them set up. Uh, so what I do is I have a real controller on player 1. So I have that as X input because I'm using an Xbox. But the device class, I have it as standard pad PS3 control. Now players 2, 3, 4, and 5. You're gonna all you're gonna have all of those on default keyboard uh, setup. So default, 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 default. Except each one is gonna have a different device class. So I have player two as drum guitar hero, player three as drum rock band pro, player four as drum rock uh, drum guitar hero, and then player five as drum rock revolution. Then we can just hit save. Let's go back into our game. So I'm using my real controller now, and I'm going to press start. It's going to say, do you want to save progress? So we're going to set up everything we want to do before we bring in our all instruments. So we're going to go into options, RB3 settings, and do like venue setup. I like Ru uh, Moscow, Russia. It's a good one. Uh, venue FPS, we're going to move that to like 60, because, you know, of course we are. Doop, 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 60. Uh, track speed, music speed's fine, but now we're going to go in and actually like get our song ready. So we're gonna go into our song list, press select, and it's like I want my keys, I want my pro guitar, I want my three-part harmonies and two-part harmonies. I want to make sure I have everything perfect. Oh man, you know what? I really want to make sure that it's gonna be a really hard song. So let's make sure it's like, you know, hard. Uh, and then like we're gonna go down here and it's like, okay, so this has pro everything and harmonies. Perfect, that's the song I wanna do. All right, press start on our controller. We're gonna go to options and then we're gonna go to modifiers and start going up. And you're gonna see these two that are GH drums, GH keys. Uh, you're just going to click each of them, see how a keyboard popped up, see how a guitar uh, popped up in both slots and they're pro. Perfect. Now we're going to go up one more time and we do autoplay. It's going to make us have autoplay. You don't have to turn on song title always. It'll automatically keep it on screen. So we are done here. Um, we're going to go back out and now we're going to go to our keyboard now. So enter is going to be start. X is going to be, you know, X, and then C is going to be circle. So that's pretty much all you're going to need. So what we're going to do is we're going to press enter, and it's going to bring up everybody. Now we're going to press X to say yes to this, but we're going to go down with our arrow keys and go and press X for that, because we don't want to see these career features, right? And since we press X on every controller, we're going to need to go and press back and press X again to go back to the set list. Now, now that we're almost there, we're gonna press start on our controller again, options, and turn on all instrument mode. And then we're gonna see a keyboard, bam. Do you want to save? Sure. Uh, and then bam, here we are. That's not the song that I wanted, but you know what, it's all right. The Dying Soul 2X bass pedal, perfect. Uh, no, and then, so we're, we just press X to go in, we're going to press down once, and then everybody's going to go to its pro instrument, press X, experts automatically selected, X, and then there we are, all instrument mode, on a venue, pro guitar, pro keys, pro drums, vocal harmonies, the entire works, all auto-playing for your pleasure.